All right, so I'm going to answer one of the most commonly asked questions, and that's um, how to reset the tyre pressure. Warning, so you can see in a moment, there we go. So you'll get this warning sign come up saying uh, pressure loss. So obviously the first thing to do is check the actual tyre, so it's suggesting that there's a loss of pressure on the left-hand tyre. So go petrol station or um, use your air canister, uh, get it back to the correct pressure. Um, just to show you your to find the air pressures on this so this is a Q2 it's just on the driver's door there it's front and rear correct pressures obviously the tyre size so this has the 225 55 17 inch alloys it's Q2 Sport this one is but yeah 28 30 psi sorry uh 28 rear baker read that there we go um anyway so back in the car so what we need to do is go to press menu and select car now it's hidden in this menu here so to access whenever you see a little tab to the left or right means there's a hidden menu to access that you can either press this button we can actually move this left, right, up and down. So that brings us into that there. And then just scroll down to servicing and checks. Tire pressure lost indicator. Click on that and then just press store tire pressures. Yes, store now. And that will reset it. So the lights disappeared off the clock there. Um, if it detects a loss in pressure, I think it's a, a drop in one or two psi. The um, symbol will come back on the screen, and then obviously you just go through it, check same procedure, check the tire pressure, and then uh, go back into that menu there. So just a reminder: so you press menu, scroll up to car, cross to the left, down to servicing and checks, tire pressure loss indicator. Simple as that. Thank you very much.